The 61st annual Primetime Emmy nominations are just about to be announced, and we are going to be taking you live to the Academy Theater in North Hollywood, California, where the announcements will be made any second now by Television Arts and Sciences Chairman John Schaefer, from CBS, The Big Bang Theory's Jim Parsons, he plays Sheldon, he's been on the show many times, and Grey's Anatomy star Chandra Wilson. And this year, unlike last year, the nominees were chosen 100% by popular vote, and there will be six nominees instead of five in the major categories. Let's go there live right now. Good morning. I'm John Schaffner, Chairman of the Board of the Academy of Television Arts and Sciences, and it is my pleasure to welcome you to the 61st Prime Time Emmy Awards announcements. Joining me this morning to present the nominations are two wonderfully talented actors, Chandra Wilson, who currently stars in the ABC series Grey's Anatomy, and Jim Parson, who stars in the CBS series The Big Bang Theory. Chandra, Jim, thank you. Both so much for joining us. You know, I understand that both of your careers started in Houston, Texas. Yes, that's absolutely true. That's very true. But I want to say we're really glad that you're here in Hollywood. Well, thank so you. So thank you. So <laughs> continue. Very good. All right. Thank you, John. And good morning, everybody. Chandra, ladies first, please. Thank you very much, Jim. Uh, the nominations in the drama series category are Big Love, Breaking Bad, Damages, Dexter, House, Lost, and Mad Men. The nominations for <laughs> lead actress in a drama series are Sally Field, Brothers and Sisters, Kira Sedgwick, The Closer, Glenn Close, Damages, Marishka Hargitay, Law and Order Special Victims Unit, Elizabeth Moss, Mad Men, and Holly Hunter, Saving Grace. <laughs> the nominees for lead actor in a drama series are Brian Cranston, Breaking Bad, Michael C. Hall, Dexter, Hugh Laurie, House, Gabriel Byrne, In Treatment, John Hamm, Mad Men, and Simon Baker, The Mentalist. The Made for Television movie nominations are Coco Chanel, Grey Gardens, Into the Storm, Prayers for Bobby, and Taking Chance. That was a ticking. I, I took that. that. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> the nominees for the miniseries category are Generation Kill and Little Dorrit. The nominees for lead actress in a miniseries or movie are Shirley MacLaine, Coco Chanel, Drew Barrymore, Grey Gardens, Jessica Lange, Grey Gardens, Sigourney Weaver, Prayers for Bobby, and Chandra Wilson, Accidental hey, Friendship. Hello, Congratulations. Hello. That was not on there. <laughs> That's new. Oh, okay. Uh, going to the party. All right. Uh, the <laughs> nominees for lead actor in a miniseries or a movie are Kevin Kline, Cyrano de Bergerac, Great Performances, uh, Brendan Gleeson, Into the Storm, Sir Ian McKellen, uh, King Lear, Great Performances, Kevin Bacon, Taking Chance, Keeper Sutherland, 24 Redemption, and Kenneth Branagh, Wallander, One Step Behind. Here are this year's nominees for Reality Competition Program. The Amazing Race, American Idol, Dancing with the Stars, Project Runway, and Top Chef. And Jim, here's a category that hasn't been announced on this broadcast before. Outstanding Variety, Music, or Comedy Series. And the nominees are... The Colbert Report, uh, The Daily Show with Jon Stewart, Late Show with David Letterman, Real Time with Bill Maher, and Saturday Night Live. The nominees for lead actress in a comedy series are Julia Louis-Dreyfus, The New Adventures of Old Christine, Christina Applegate, Samantha Who, Sarah Silverman, The Sarah Silverman Program, Tina Fey, 30 Rock, Tony Collette, United States of Terra, and Mary Louise Parker, Weeds. For lead actor in a comedy series, the nominees are Jermaine Clement, Flight of the Concords, Tony Shalhoub, Monk, Steve Carell, The Office, Alec Baldwin, 30 Rock, Charlie Sheen, Two and a Half Men, and Jim Parsons, no. The Big Bang. <laughs> yes. That was not on there either. I know, they're messing with this us. This is some sort of trick fest. 
<laughs> um, well, Chandra, back to the prompter. Let's uh, complete the Emmy announcements by bringing back John Schaffner to announce our final category. Oh, oh congratulations. Thank you. To both You're a very of you. tricky man. You messed this up. Look at our hands shaking it. Hello again. <laughs> the nominations in the comedy series category are Entourage, Family Guy, Flight of the Concords, How I Met Your Mother, The Office, 30 Rock, and Weeds. Chandra, Jim, you have been great hosts this morning, and I have to, it is completely coincidental <laughs> that you have both been nominated. But Chandra, I have even more good news oh for boy, you. You, you have also been nominated in the supporting actress okay. category for your performance on Grey's Anatomy. Okay. So I, I cannot tell you. I, I wish I could, uh, you know, I, I, it's inappropriate to say how surprised we were that you were both nominated, but how thrilled we are too. Thank so you. thank you. Thank you very so much. much. Very you both fun. deserve that. Thank you. Here's a complete list of all the Emmy nominees on our website, emmys.com. But be sure to join us on September 20th on the CBS Television Network when we open the envelopes. So from all of us here at the Television Academy, thanks for joining us this morning. We'll see you at the Emmys. Hey. And we have a nominee with us. Congratulations for the Thank nomination of Entourage, Best Comedy Series, fourth year in a row, right? Fourth year in a row, yes. Yeah. So it's a big deal. Very, very excited. So. Maybe this really, is the year they take it. Yeah, when the when they nomination came, you were really pumped. Well, yeah, it's a big, it's a big thing. It's a big thing, even more so than like the individual awards. It's that's the kind of award that keeps the show mm -hmm. going. And at the end of the day. That's the most important thing. We want to do eight years, as many years as we can get out of it. So this is a, it's a step in the right direction. So. Some people said the show had an off-season creative the last season. So was it validating to actually get this nomination? They obviously didn't know much about what they were talking about, <laughs> did they? Uh, Mike Asiello knows what he's talking about. He is a columnist for Entertainment Weekly. Entourage is great, but it has some good competition, too, in that category. Yeah. Um, the, the big surprise, pleasant surprise, uh, How I Met Your Mother, finally making the cut in Best My Comedy favorite. Series. Sorry. Um, <laughs> personally, Sorry. though, also... My I'm, favorite on broadcast television. Exactly. How's that? How's that? And I'm not saying this because we're on CBS, but the Jim Parsons nomination was a personal highlight for me. I mean, yeah. it was like I was really pulling for him. And unfortunately, the show, Big Bang Theory, didn't get nominated. But, you know, it's a start. Jim got, made the cut. Maybe next year the show will finally get in there. Let's talk about other nominations. First yeah. of all, drama. Uh, big love. You cheered huge oh, when yes. they said that. Oh, yes. I was so excited because that show, to me, is the best drama on television. And it doesn't get a lot of love uh, from, <laughs> from the, the public or whatever. For whatever reason, it's kind of under the radar. So yeah. that was really nice. That it's it's such a good there. Show. It's yeah. such a great show. Very complicated. Um, but again, has big competition once again from Mad Men, last year's winner. I think that's going to be uh, coming to the ceremony as the front Which runner. Which shows it wasn't just a fluke because a lot of people said when, when Mad Men came out. Yeah. No, so, it's a great show, Mad Men. Oh, it really is a really great is. show. Um, and then um, also on, on the comedy side, uh, Family Guy making the cut in there for an animated show. Is that the first show. time? It's, I don't, it's not the first time, but right. it's interesting. Uh, they choose to, to to go into the, the regular comedy, comedy category instead of animated. That, right. Mm -hmm. So, and it paid off for them. Yeah, How about you. Julia Louis-Dreyfus getting a nomination uh, for yeah. she's Christine? So good. And she's, yeah. she's won before, so. And can somebody explain very, very quickly, so the, who votes? The, the, the nominees, for the nominees, the public. Yeah. Last okay. year they had it a little bit different. They had a panel vote. Okay. But this year was 100% by popular vote. Wow. Yeah. There you go. Mike, thank you so, so there much. There you go. They love Entourage. That's mm -hmm. it. Keep it coming. There you go, Kevin. You can see the 61st Annual Emmy Awards on Sunday, September 20th at 8 p.m. 7 Central right here on CBS.